welcome back to my channel it's Nicole and I know it's been a while and I didn't really know when I was gonna come back uh, but I'm back for a while um, I just wanted to keep people up to date with where I'm at right now and talk to you about something that is, I think is really exciting uh, I recently launched a new art blog yeah crazy as it sounds uh, no it's not crazy um, yeah, I wanted to just give you a, a little sort of preview, really, um, from myself, just to talk about why, what the rationale of that was. Um, I just wasn't happy with the um, the previous website that I had, and I knew, and I, and I had a blog attached to that, and uh, so I, I decided to, to sort of branch away from that company. That was they were called um, site one two three, uh, and just go back to or well not really back forward to doing my own much more of my own thing um, in Blogger, and because that's I'm kind of used to that platform and, and I and I quite like uh, the way that it's set up, and um, so that's what I've done, and that's the same system that I use. Or software that I use for my um, writing blog, so it, it was familiar, you know, to me. And you can you can create a similar setup to a website, so you know you can add pages, you can do so much. So I thought, right, let me do that. Um, so when you visit my new art blog, which I hope you will do, and the link is in in the description below, um, you'll see that I've got about five blog posts on there. And I launched it on the second anniversary of George Floyd's murder. I uh, deliberately did want to do that. And I did, a, a, so you'll find that the first post that you come across will be that one. And I talk about all sorts of things, not necessarily all about the US, more about the police brutality in, in the UK. Um, it's something I wrote about in my assignment when I focused on what used to what was what is known as the London riots which took place in 2011 um, and I don't want to go into too much detail because I've, I've got a lot that I said on on that post so if you want to check that out go ahead um, there's some videos on there and the videos are similar well they are the same ones as I chose four of the um, journey the art journey ones to, because you know some people who go on the blog don't necessarily know about the art channel um, video channel but they will see a link there anyway so you know I'm kind of trying to link everything together uh, I've got the gallery there of the center stage women of color portraiture series of those 10 paintings uh, so I have I have bought a lot of things from the uh, previous website but not everything and uh, and then I've got a couple of pieces of abstract realism and I talk about what abstract realism is. And then I've, I've got a page called Community Art Projects. Just to, I like the idea of community art projects and you can see at least three that I've been involved with over the years. Um, what else is there? Audio. I know. So a couple of people had mentioned when, they, when they'd been in touch with me on my other website whether or not I could include audio uh, of the the you know the articles that I was writing because a few of them were on you know maybe they were commuting on on route to work uh, and another person said she was finding it difficult because she, you know her she had a problem with her, her her site so you know I'm trying to make my a new art blog as accessible as possible so I did you know I took on board what the these comments uh, were saying you know and I thought you know what I'm gonna look into it and in the end I, I found the best way for me at the moment was to use SoundCloud uh, clips and you'll find them at the top of the blog posts and they are a summary of the post I wasn't going to um, read the whole post. Um, I'm not sure that's something I want to do 
it may be something I think about doing in the future, I don't know. But I certainly wanted to do the summary and, and I, I think I really enjoyed um, setting all those audios up. Um, so if anyone's got a SoundCloud account, SoundCloud account and that's a free, you can create a free account, it's easy to do, you can listen to those. You do have to have an, a SoundCloud, SoundCloud um, account so that you can what you know listen to what i've got to say which is it's just i just think it's if it gives people a different flavor a little bit of a, an added dynamic and i'm really quite i quite liked doing them and i'm so if you want to know how often i'll be posting on that art blog it'll be once a month around the 25th of the month approximately and there is an option to subscribe to the blog when you get there so you will never miss any posts and I'd like people to get involved with you know leaving comments and you know you don't have to be an artist to do that um, whether you're an artist or not everyone's welcome to engage with me and I look forward to hearing from you there feel free to get in touch by email too um, or by the contact page you know there's a contact section on on the on the home page and you can get in touch with me there. The only thing you do have to do is um, provide a, you know your name and email address. And there's also a privacy policy on this blog, which you can access from the bottom of the page. So that's my commitment to keeping any and all of your personal information confidential, secure and private. And yeah, so that's it for now. I'm going to do another video which gives you an update about my studies and where I'm at. I can tell you that I'm going down the road of dissertation. I have um, a large research project to do. The topic is the role of the black female image in British advertising. So yeah, I will be doing a little video about my topic and what made me choose that topic and um, yeah the rationale and what some of the questions will be that I want to answer okay so yeah speak to you soon thanks for watching and bye for now